Hello everybody, it's story time once again and we're about ready to get started. Unfortunately I only have one of my assistants because the other one was a little sick and he had to go to bed. So he is not going to be joining us tonight but we will do this anyway. So what would you like in your story? Cats. 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 And what would you like, what's the name of a cat? Flaggy. Flaggy? Flaggy. Not the name I would have picked, but okay, it's inventive. Flaggy. Flaggy the cot. This is the tale of Flaggy the cot. He lived not far from this place a long time ago when the earth was young and had dinosaurs in it. Had dinosaurs roam the land. You see, Flaggy was not an ordinary cat. No. He lived in a cat town. And he lived there all by himself. And his job was to take care of the horses. There was not horses back in that time. Okay, fine. You are a very picky butt little girl. Just to let you know, you're a very pain in my butt. Okay? How about if the horses go? Okay, fine. Yeah. His job was the to dinosaurs. take care of dinosaurs. dinosaurs that you ride. How about that? Does that work for you? Yeah. Pain in my butt. You're cute, <laughs> but pain in my butt. Okay, so his job was to take care of the horse like dinosaurs. Okay? We good? You happy with that? Yep. Okay, fantastic. We'll go with that. Okay, so his job was to take care of the horse-like dinosaurs. And he'd get up and do you know what his main job was? Yeah. It was not a very nice job. The dinosaurs. No, he didn't want, he wanted to ride the dinosaurs. He didn't want to have to do his job. His job was to go clean up all the poop that was in the barn. Do you hear me? All the poop. Yep. Would you like to go clean up all the poop in the barn? No. You gotta get the shovel and get down there with the... <laughs> 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 it's a fart. <laughs> and do you see how much poop dinosaurs make? What? Do you know how much poop they make? They make a lot of poop. <laughs> piles and piles of poop. And her job was to go scoop out all the poop. Do you know how deep it went? How? All the way to our belly. That's how big the piles were. She had to get down there and clean it every day. Was she happy with the job? No. no. It stunk. <laughs> it stunk. And the dinosaurs kept pooping. Every time she'd come to the barn, it'd be a mess. She'd look at this. Can't you keep it clean for five freaking seconds? No? Jeez. I gotta go scoop the poop. You like the sound effects? I know they're kind of crappy, but still. So she kept doing that every day. She kept doing that. But one day, there was a big T-Rex that came to the village. It started, it came in, crashed into the village and started eating everybody. Nom, 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 nom. And they couldn't stop him. His skin was too tough. Bite him. Bite him. They tried biting him. But his skin was too tough. They broke all their teeth. It hurt really, really bad. Um, they drained him. But then they got headaches. They're cats after all. They're not, not rams. They tried using swords. But it didn't work. They all got eaten. Well, along came Floppy. And 
went up to the big bad T-Rex and said, You do not scare me! And the T-Rex looked down at the little cat and said, Chinese food! <laughs> uh, what is that terrible smell? It smells like a hundred dinosaur butts! <laughs> all scooped next to each other! And the cat just looked up and said, Sorry, it's been a long day. Had a lot of dinosaur poopy to scoop. Um, and dinosaur. The T Rex. Go away, you stink too much. Oh, I'm getting a headache. You stink so bad. You poopy kitty catty thingy. <laughs> the cat just looked at him and said, Hmm, I got an idea. What happens if I give you a hug? Ew. Come here. I want to give you a hug. <laughs> the tears go, No! I don't want a hug! You stink! Go away! Go away! I don't want to touch you. You little clock. You stink. That's horrible. Ew, you smell bad. Go away. Okay. Okay, okay, come on. I want to give you a hug. <laughs> you don't want to taste some of this? I mean, you were eating all the other cats. Why don't you eat me? When I taste good. It's okay. No! <laughs> you would taste like crap. <laughs> And you smell like it too! <laughs> Go away, I don't want to smell like that. I'd have crap. You know, I'd have crap breath the rest of the week if I ate you. My breath would smell like crap. It would be horrible. <laughs> All the other dinosaur ladies would run away from me. I would be very, very lonely. <laughs> Cat kid coming! And the dinosaur kept back and Go away! I don't want to mess with you! The cat said, okay, fine. Walked away. And I said, oh, man, that cat stunk. Where are the other cats? I want to eat something. I'm getting hungry. And just then, Floppy came back with a pitchfork full of dinosaur poopy. <laughs> and flung it at the T-Rex and it hit him right on the nose. Ah! <laughs> it smelled really bad. Why do you do that? I don't know if I say cat scratch. I can't scratch my nose. I got two short fingers. I can't get it. Ah! And he ran away. And all the other all the other cats were, yay! <laughs> and Fluffy was the big hero. And from now on, Fluffy never had to clean up the poop ever again. Why? Because he was a hero. The end. What do you think of that? Good. You give it a thumbs up? Very good. Thank you guys so much for liking the video and commenting on it. And hit that subscribe button and we will see you guys on the flip side. Bye!